another video here on TK808 Productions. I'm your host, Mr. TK808, and thank you guys for tuning into my channel, and a happy new year to everybody. Today we got the fast gas bracket from the last race from November at the Maui Raceway Park. Anyway, you guys, here we go. Time they're gonna run. Jill gets down there first with a 984 at 137 miles per hour, while Kelsey gets a 1019 at 144 miles per hour. Moving on to the next group, we have Kyle Schmissu and Max Hauser. We're gonna get Sean Zetanaka, the Hard Love Dragster. Both of these guys are Kyle crosses the line with 813 at 164 miles per hour. Sean gets 843 at 154 miles per hour. Then we have the dog. It's John Shields, our great top dragster. He's going to call the team a great top. Off the line, it gets crazy. If you haven't checked out my YouTube channel, check out this man, Danny Wickham. He tells us all about how he's going to be a good cop. Time at a 735, 183 miles per hour. Then he gets there with a 10, 4, 3, 129 miles per hour. Whoo, that drives us fast. I'm a truck before he was going to cross into the left lane. Corey gets down there with a 704 at 190 miles per hour. It looks like Rob's going to just cruise to a 1324 at 84 miles per hour. We have Ted Leach in his silver dragster against the other person with the mountain racing team. Ricky Kamatani. Quick 
quick launch off the line. 10, a little bit stuttering back there. Looks like he let off the gas. We're going to just cruise down. Ricky cross the finish line at a 746, 178 miles per hour. Ted just goes with a 1298. Couldn't really get the miles per hour on video, but no worries. So that's another round to follow. Scott got up to Wild Ride Vega. It's Scott to Gano up in the smoke. Why is that Wild Ride up in the smoke? Scott Tagano gets there first with a 951 at 140 miles per hour. Scott Yarata gets there with a 995, 132 miles per hour. Randy Bruce Stockton in the Galus Chevelle. Beautiful car. down the drag ship. See what he crosses at a time of. Crosses at a time at nine seconds flat at 149 miles per hour. Now give you guys a little heads up. The reason why I got so late in that for a round two qualifying, there was a lot of breakdowns of vehicles, a lot of oil downs, so we had to stop. But hey, drag racing, it does not stop. We keep going. Round two of qualifying. off the line very good oh it looks like robin's still struggling and making sure the car goes straight that's off the gas kyle crosses the finish line at 809 161 miles per hour all right next group coming up ricky kamitani in the orange mountain man racing dragster a quick short little burnout Okay. 
Crosses the line first with a 74,679 miles per hour. Then he gets there with a 995 at 133 miles per hour. The other racer of the is Mori Yamashita. Small block back to power. Second pass, 698 at 196 miles per hour. Joe gets down there with a 998 at 137 miles per hour. Woo! See what some nitrous can do to you guys. Now he gets Scotty up to the Wild Ride Vega. Finish line first at what time? Randy gets down there with an 899 at 149 miles per hour. Scott gets with a 998 at 132 miles per hour. Moving on, we got John Shirota, the crazy pop dragster. Second pass. Burn out by both racers. Now, here we go. Let's see the team off the sideline. Ted gets off a little bit early, but no worries. It's only qualifying. Woo! Get a little bit skatish out there for John Shirota. But he pulls off another time at a 723 at 183 miles per hour. Tag got a 904 at 91 miles per hour. Looks like he kind of let off the gas a little bit near the end. But at least he was able to make down a pass. Coming in the last group is Sean Motonaga in the Hard Luck Drexler. Scott Degano in the Smoke. Scott, a little bit sleepy, but don't worry, it's only qualifying. Shaw gets out there with 846, 154 miles per hour. Scott gets a 937, 149 miles per hour. Now, now, what are the issues? You can go away. It's still got the best reaction time. It's still got the best reaction time. Never know why I call it a speed of scope and turn off the watch it.
what she makes on her time. Comes at a 984 at 137 miles per hour. Next we have coming up, we have John Chirota going up to battle against Denny Wickham. John Chirota driving the crazy pop dragster while Denny Wickham is driving the Taj. with a 735 at 172 miles per hour. Then he gets there with a 989 at 135 miles per hour. Next group coming out, we have Randy Wood Stockton. Then he gets Scott Hirata, Wild Ride Vega. times by both racers. Will Randy in the left lane catch him or will Scott hold him off? And it looks like Scott will hold him off with a 998 at 132 miles per hour. Randy gets to an 898 at 158 miles per hour. Congratulations to Scott Yurata. We'll be on to the next round. Bobby Yurata in the blue studio against Scott Tigano in the Upland Smoke Camaro. When they back up, as you're going to see right there, one of their track officials is going to go and check the look. John Fukumoto's his name, I finally remember his name. He goes, he checks on the track, he looks at it, and he's just like, nope, that's oil, he cuts them off because they've been, that night we've been having so many delays, oil dials, cars breaking down, we had to pull them off. Robin will take the first win for this round. Well, Robin does. straight heads to the center lets off the gas because that's dangerous when you have a car going that fast going to the center so he lets it off the gas lets it coast down for the win moving on Ricky Kamatani and the Nazis oh it looks like both Nazis men are racing against each other Ricky Kamatani Koi Yamashita It's Corey Yamashita with a 697, 191 miles per hour. Woo! 696 second pass. Ricky gets there with a 741, 179 miles per hour. Oh man, another six second pass by Corey Yamashita. Congratulations, Corey moves on. It's going to be Sean Motsunaga. He was supposed to be racing against Kelson Vradomo in the white Mazda, but unfortunately the Mazda broke down after the first qualifying pass. Let's see what he's going to run at the finish line. 
Cross is in at 834 at 154 miles per hour. Supposed to be facing 10 each in the silver dragster, but unfortunately, that silver dragster also was having engine problems as well, so couldn't make it to this round. So, Kyle Shimizu moves on to the next round. I would say. Comes at a time at 8.02 at 164 miles per hour. Ooh, knocking on that seven second door. And now we're moving on to the round number two of the nations. We have Lama Grafta, Blue GTO, the Crazy Park Rexer, Don Chirota. Finish first. It's John Chirota with a 739, 184 miles per hour. Robin Chirota gets there with a time of 8 seconds flat, 163 miles per hour. Ooh, you guys see that wheelie from that dragster? Ooh, that's why they call it the crazy rock dragster. Next group we have coming up is Sean Montanaga and our luck dragster going against Jill Collis in the World Peace Nova. Sipping on the line, let's see if we can catch Jill at the end. No, oh, Jill takes the win at a 991 and 129 miles per hour. Shaw gets there with a 838 and 154 miles per hour. Congratulations to Jill Collis. Moving on to the next round. Next group coming up is Kyle Schultz. Up against Scott Hirata in the Wild Ride Vega. Much of the line, so does Kyle. Will Kyle catch him at the end? And he does! Gets there with an 801 and 165 miles per hour. Scott also gets on the finish line at 995, 134 miles per hour. But looks like Kyle Shimizu will take the win and head on to the semifinals. Mario like Machita, last pair group of this stage. down there with a 695 at 198 miles per hour. Woo! Awesome job. Now time for the semi-finals. Coming up now is Jill Collis in the right lane. John Chirota and the Crazy Buck Dragster. Jill 
Scholars in the World Peace Goma. Shirota, oh, he gets the red light, gets the win, gives the win away to Jill Collins at a 935, 137 miles per hour. Jill, she will be making her way to the finals. Now, Kao Shimizu. Going up against Corey Yamashita. Yamashita with a 715 and 179 miles per hour. Kao trying to get back into it with an 802 and 155, but Corey probably caught him down at the end. Corey will face Jill Collins in the finals. All right, everyone. What we all been waiting for the finals of the fast gas bracket. Corey Yamashita, Mountain Man Dragster. Collis, aka the Queen of Smoke. Crosses the line at a 694 198 miles per hour. Jill gets a 982 at a 137 miles per hour. Big congratulations to Corey Yamashita for taking the fast gas bracket win and winning it all. Also, congratulations to Jill Collis for making it all the way to the finals and becoming the runner up. Appreciate you guys for watching this video all the way to the end. Thank you so much. Glad you enjoyed it. I'll see you guys on the next video. Have a wonderful day and aloha.